one I titled Eat That Cake, Drink That Drink. And when I titled it in my head, I kind of felt like singing it. Eat that cake, drink that drink. All right, here's what I mean by that, guys. If you're terrified about eating something bad off your meal plan, and you feel like it's gonna just crumble everything, I'm here to tell you it's not. Because we're trying to create long lasting habits. We're trying to create the new you, the new lifestyle. The Fit and 42 lifestyle is not don't have carbs, don't have sweets, can't drink, and I gotta stay inside, and I gotta read books every night. No, the Fit and 42 lifestyle is, hey, I'm active, I care about myself, I take care of myself, I eat healthy, I'm nice to people, I'm bettering myself constantly, I'm, I'm, I'm in a, a quest to get smarter and to learn more and to help more people and be better to my community. That's what it's about. So when my clients or our members come up to me, they say, oh, I can't eat that. Like, now I'm not talking about when you're on the Fit and 42 program. When you're in that, you're all in. We don't want you slipping one bit because we're trying to reprogram you, create new habits. So if you're a part of the Fit and 42 program itself that we run two times a year, this is not for you, this message. You're all in, you're following that to a T because we, that is like a scientific program that we've created, all right? This is about when you're in your everyday life and the mindset I want you to have. When people say, I can't eat that, I can't, you know, it's just, it's, it's, I can't eat those things or I can't do that, right? Like, that worries me because I want this to be your lifestyle where, you know what, I can't have that, I can have it. Because I know tomorrow I'm back to my meal plan. I'm going to eat what I'm supposed to eat. Or I deserve to eat that because I'm eating the right thing all the time. So I'm not going to hold back. Or I might not eat that whole piece of cake. I might have half of it and just get rid of the rest of it. Throw it away or give it away to somebody, whatever. I'm going to have that drink because you know what? That's no big deal. I'm back to the gym tomorrow. I'm going to, I'm going to eat on my meal plan tomorrow. I'm going to follow my healthy eating. So I don't want you to have the mindset of like, oh, I can't do this, I can't do that, because that's a, that's a mindset that's setting you up for failure. We don't wanna pull things away from ourselves and say, I can't do that. We just want you to do a whole lot less. A whole lot less of the cake and the drinks, but you can have them, but it's, on, it's in absolute positive moderation, like once in a while. But once you feel like you're, you're taking away from yourself, you're banning yourself from something, that's when we might start, when we have a moment of weakness, we might start trying to, you know, I deserve this, I'm, screw this, I'm just gonna have this. Cause like, then you might try to sabotage yourself because you feel like you can't do something and then you're gonna get back at yourself. The whole psychological child in us is trying to like, just, just rebel. So, Remember that guys, like you're able to have these things, but you gotta get your minds right. This Fit and 42 lifestyle is about taking care of yourself. Not eating completely clean and that's it, end of story. No, that's, we want you to eat healthy. We want you to eat real foods. I want you to eat uh, foods that you know what they are, what they're made of. That's what we want. But if you feel like, hey, you know what? I'm in a good mood, I wanna go have a drink tonight, or I wanna have uh, a brownie. I don't know what, whatever you want, guys. You do you. But if you start taking away from yourself, I know how that story ends. I know how the story ends if people go one way, like so one way. The pendulum swings, guys. You know, after our Fit and 42 program, we introduce people back into the real world, and it's not like you can't eat this way ever again. We want to teach you how to eat super clean for six weeks, how to clean out your body, eat really good foods, and then introduce slowly again after the six weeks foods you want, your cheat meals, and you'll, you'll know how they make your body feel when you start introducing dirtier foods to your diet. But hey, it's your choice to, if, it, might, it might be worth it. You might be like, oh, I'm gonna feel like crap tomorrow, but 
you know, it makes me happy. I want to do it. And that's fine. Totally cool with that. But don't take away from yourself. That's when you're going to start. That's when you're, you're going to, um, the pendulum's going to swing the other way. And I can't tell you how many people I've seen just act like they're never going to do something ever again. Let's talk about eating. I'm never, I'm never going to go back to that. Like, no, that's, that's not it. It's not about never going back. It's about just knowing that how good I feel eating clean most of the time. And then if I want to go out with my friends, have pizza party, whatever, I'm going to do that. I'm not going to be like, I can't do that. That's not me. I can't. Maybe that's not you. I'm fine. But most people, that mentality is going to lead to back to where you were or you started or way worse. And I don't want that for you guys. So I want you to eat that cake, drink that drink when you want to. And then you're back the next day. You're back on it. You feel good about yourself. You rewarded yourself. You're not a child. You eat like an adult. You don't eat candies and sugars and, sh and sodas all day. You reward yourself for doing solid, committed, dedicated lifestyle. Then you just, you splurge once in a while. All right, guys. <sighs> Hopefully you enjoyed this one. Hopefully when you feel like you're saying that to yourself, you say, you know, Jerry said I should have this but I got to get my mind right and make sure to stay on track. All right, guys, have a great day. Live that Fit and 42 life. Be kind to people. Be first. When you pass somebody, say hi to them. You'll make their day. And do me a favor. This is what I like to do. A-R-E. Appreciate, recognize, encourage. Try to do that to somebody. Appreciate them, recognize them, encourage them. It goes a long way. See you guys. Have a great night.